Well, a new study shows that one out of every four kids is bullied at school, and that is why uh, there is a local director of Theater of the Imagination, Miles McMahon. He goes around to schools and he tries to teach kids about bullying, about the negative effects of it. Miles, thanks for joining us this morning. Thank you. Tell me a little bit about this uh, effort that you do when you go to the schools and why do you do it? Well, bullying is such a huge problem, and especially with the internet, kids can get cyberbullied 24 hours a day. So our program called Stop the Bully is designed to go into schools and community groups. We're performing this at Irish Fest tonight and trying to find a way to educate kids about what they can do to stop bullying. Were you bullied as a kid? Absolutely, yeah, I was, and I was, I was terrified of it. And I didn't have the tools for knowing what to do about it, and so that's one of the things that inspired me to, to research this. And so you teach these kids how to have the tools and, and how to approach bullies? Well, no, is what to do when you get dealt with a bully. I mean, most kids, like you said, one in four kids gets bullied now, and what do you do about it? And so I wrote a play, and I tour this to schools. It's called Stop the Bully, and we're theater of the imagination, and we're going to do a little play for you right now. All right, we have one minute. This is a one-minute play. All right, Miles, go ahead. Okay. Hey, everybody, how do you feel? Good. How do you look? Great. But most important, how is your hair? Wow. Why, once upon a time in the Old West, there were some cowboys. They had the best shampoo this side of Old Perry. Look at that purdy hair. But some bullies came along, and these bullies were mean. They were nasty. And they were looking for a good conditioner. Why, the bullies, they were hitting the townsfolk. They were calling them names. They were giving them, they were giving them dirty looks. And the townsfolk were sad, scared, filled with woe. And bullies love it when you feel bad. The bullies were drinking the fear. They were eating the anger. But luckily, the townsfolk knew the five steps to dealing with a bully. Step one, take it slow. Step two, tall and true. Step three, get a buddy. Step four, just ignore. Step five, shield alive. Why, and when they followed the five steps, the bullies, they had no fear to drink, no anger to eat, and they started starving. And they never bothered the townsfolk again. Hey, everybody, how do you feel? Good. How do you look? Great. But most important, how's your hair? Give him a dance. <laughs> that is great. Wow, some great actors here. And Miles, you say when you go to these schools, I mean, you don't bring these kids with you. You grab kids out of the audience to perform. Yeah, when we perform this at schools, what we do is we just do an assembly program. We pull kids right up out of the audience. They get to get up and be in the show. So the great thing is, is for the kids watching, they get to see their classmates do it. It's much more exciting, much more engaging than, you know, than just like, you know, another guy <laughs> that they don't know telling them what to do. Well, and you're seeing the results of this? Absolutely. We've had a great response. Response. We've been touring this all over uh, schools all over Kansas City. It's called Stop the Bully. And uh, yeah, we've, we've had a lot of schools get a lot of positive response from it. All right, Miles McMahon, Theater of the Imagination. What's your website? DramaKC.com. DramaKC.com. Piece of cake. Kids, thank you so much for joining us. Some great <laughs> acting going on here in the atrium. Kelly, Gary, let's head over to you now. That was awesome.